Hi there, it's Kevin Ward, the founder of Yes Masters Real Estate Success Training and the author of the number one best-selling book, The Book of Yes, The Ultimate Real Estate Agent Conversation Guide. But this is not about a script. This is not about real estate. This is about a first impression. And everybody knows that they say you have, you know, 30 seconds to make a great first impression. And the reality is some, in some ways you don't even have that long. In some ways people make a first impression of you within, within literally a matter of one or two seconds from the moment they see you. And that first look, that first expression on your face when they see you makes a huge difference. And so in this video, we're gonna talk about how to create, how to make the best first impression. And there are really three steps to making an amazing first impression. In fact, it's really, there's three emotions that they need to see in you and from you that cause people to have the best first impression possible of, of you. And that all boils down to how do you show up? How do you show up and what emotions do they feel from you? Do they sense for you? And in that process, what emotions do, uh, do you create in them when they meet you, when they see you, when they connect with you? And so it's a very simple process that once you create the habit of showing up this way. So there's three emotions that you must exude from you anytime you meet somebody and you want to make a great first impression. Number one, and you may can guess it. Make a guess. <laughs> Here it is. If you guessed happy, you are right. The, the best first impression that you can ever make with somebody is when they first see you and this is how you make, how you appear and how you make them feel. There's instant attraction. There is very few things that are more attractive to other people than someone who just is happy. Because happiness is contagious. So if you want to have the greatest first impression, the very first thing is you got to be happy. Now, I, I, all of the things that are included in this are things like eye contact and, you know, when you look at somebody and shaking their hand, having a firm handshake and all of those, but those are all techniques. I'm talking about the power and the real power to make a good first impression is all about human emotion. Emotion is the connective tissue between you and other people. Eye contact can be faked. Handshake can be trained. It's a technique. But happy? Yeah. Happiness is a choice. Happiness is an emotion that you choose. Now, I'm not talking about pasting on a fake smile because over time people can tell it's not real. There's still that vibe whenever you're truly happy. How does that show up? Happy shows up as energy. It shows up as enthusiasm. It shows up in your facial expression. Eyebrows up, not down. Smile, not frown. Okay? So that rhymed, didn't it? So number one is happy. The second emotion that people need to feel from you immediately when you see them, when you connect with them, is they need to feel interest. And that means they need to feel that you are interested in them. How do they feel that? By the way, you look at them. It's great to see you. Hi, how are you? I'm happy and I'm like into you. So it's 100%. The eye contact is all about the focus. It's all about the sense that you are meeting somebody, every person you meet, every person you meet, in fact, I wanna write this down, every single person you meet should be a VIP. You should treat and see everybody you meet as if they are a very important person because the reality is they are. And when you have that interest, when you show up that way, they feel that, that is powerful because when you're interested in them, there's nothing more attractive than the fact that you are interested in them. People love it when you're interested in them because people care about themselves and when you seem to care about them, that is powerful as well. And then number three, the third most powerful emotion that you wanna create that creates a great first impression is gratitude. You want them to feel gratitude from you. Now, this probably doesn't happen in the first two or three seconds, okay? So this is the conversation. This is that initial conversation, but it can literally happen in the first 30 seconds. 
it certainly is going to happen in the first conversation and that is just number one is having a feeling of gratitude so it's great to meet you and you want to feel you want to communicate i am grateful for this opportunity to meet you and if it's somebody you've heard about say that say i'm so grateful to get to finally meet you it's, it's, it's great to meet you i'm grateful for this opportunity and when you tell them that when you communicate to somebody gratitude what you just did is you elevate their worth you elevate their value and when you do that people are so drawn to that there is nothing more powerful in terms of connective tissue than gratitude now i want to be clear that feeling gratitude is different than expressing gratitude feeling gratitude is important because it's how you feel expressing gratitude is critical because it now changes the way they feel in fact we have the holiday the thanksgiving holiday the whole idea of thanksgiving is not it's not uh th we don't call it thankfulness day or th feel thankful day we call it thanksgiving day it's about giving it's about expressing the gratitude so when you meet somebody when you see somebody great to meet you thank you so much for taking my call thank you for talking to me Wow, it's great to meet you. Thank you for the, taking the time out of your day to have this conversation with me. It's just a really, really simple way to communicate to someone else how much you value them. And when the, you show up happy, they go like, wow, this person has a great energy. You're happy to see them. You're happy to be alive. Happiness is contagious. When you're interested in them, you're telling them you matter to me. And when they feel they matter to you, they're attracted to that and when they see that you're grateful for them when they sense that or hear gratitude from you it simply is telling them you are important and i am i feel a debt to you i feel a connection to you and that my friends is power it's the power of connective tissue it's the power that when you walk away from that relationship when you are you walk away from that initial meeting they remember you that is the great first impression you want to make.